Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And Microsoft is once again at it, making it even more difficult to install Windows 11 without a Microsoft account. So there were tricks that were used for Microsoft accounts. And they included, you know, disconnecting from the internet. And of course, there was also a uh, command line with you know, a instruction to uh, make the uh, setup skip certain features and certain things at setup. Well, now when you're actually reinstalling Windows um, from scratch, the setup process, which is called the out of the box experience, is now not allowing you to use these tricks anymore. It absolutely wants you to create a Microsoft account. And Microsoft in a blog post today said, well, the reason we decided to do this is because people skip very important uh, features and settings that they should see if they have created a Microsoft account, uh, AKA they just don't want you to skip it because they want you to have and use their features that they have with a Microsoft account, like syncing settings and stuff like that. So uh, Microsoft is testing this new way of installing and blocking pretty much every trick of Microsoft accounts. Skip uh, in the latest builds of Windows 11, which means that at some point it will come to the install process of Windows 11. And, um, you know, we see it all the time. Why do people hate Microsoft, not trust Microsoft? Because people are tired of Microsoft deciding what is good for you. Um, I am one of those that use a Microsoft account. I'm okay with it. But I totally agree that if you don't want one, you should be allowed to choose not to have a Microsoft account at setup. Uh, just like the di diagnostics data, it should be an optional thing. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.